You're watching WMAR 2 News. I'm Megan Knight with your WMAR 2 News update and get ready to pay more to register your car. The state is increasing the registration fee by a significant amount too. So starting July 1st, drivers with cars weighing under 3,500 pounds must pay $110 a year. For cars up to 3,700 pounds, it's an extra $10 every year. That's an extra $43 a year you'll pay to register your car. Owners can choose to pay each year or renew every two years. The General Assembly passed legislation this year to raise the rates as a way to make up a $2 billion deficit in the budget for the Department of Transportation. Electric vehicle owners will also have to pay an additional $100 to $125 surcharge on top of the registration renewal fee that is set to start July 1st of next year. A new restaurant now open in Baltimore's Little Italy neighborhood. It's dishes being served up with a side of youth mentorship. Soul Street is a barbecue restaurant owned by Ira Chase. He's also the founder of a nonprofit called Chasing Your Dreams. The group works with 16 to 24 year olds, helping them to gain job experience. We use that to give, these to give these individuals and young adults the interpersonal skills and, and long-term work skills they'll need to be successful. Chasing Your Dreams also provides financial planning to kids and holds outreach and fellowship events. Meanwhile, there's a new place to eat in Howard County. Smashing Grapes in Columbia now taking reservations. It's located near Merriweather. They offer wine pairings from around the world and Mediterranean cuisine. Food and drink options include wine flights, charcuterie boards, pasta, and artisan pizzas. You can find out more about new spots opening around town by going to WMAR2news.com slash local eats. And mark your calendars for the 143rd Maryland State Fair. Three weekends of summer fun starts Thursday, August 22nd, running through Sunday, September 8th. Operating hours are right there on your screen. The fair is enforcing a 6 p.m. curfew for unattended teens 18 and under. More concerts are going to be released in the coming weeks, but they've already announced two of them. Big Time Rush is performing on Saturday, September 7th. And Let's Sing Taylor, a live band experience celebrating Taylor Swift, will perform on Friday, September 6th. Well, we're dealing with beautiful temperatures out there as we're back into the upper 70s. So if you're heading down to Camden Yards, not a bad day, though we could run into a few rain showers and maybe a rumble of thunder. So that could possibly have us see a little bit of a delay. But luckily, again, these should all stay sub severe. So we're not dealing with all of that crazy weather like Monday. We'll continue to see our temperatures hanging around those mid 70s over the next few days. Mostly sunny skies for Thursday and Friday. As we enter the weekend, temperatures are bouncing back into the 80s and finally a dry one. We're continuing to see that Saturday and Sunday look to be on the drier side. And by the time we get towards Monday of next week, we are going to see another chance of some isolated rain showers with temperatures back into the mid 80s. Megan. All right, Caesar, thank you. And stay with WMAR2news.com for updates to stories throughout the day. And for your news and weather while you're on the go, download our app. Thanks for watching. I'm Megan Knight.